Yo, 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 everybody. Welcome back to another episode of Street League of Racing Red Line Budget Drifting Edition. We're out here drifting on a budget, having no money, and being very poor. Look at this car, man. Look at this thing. Oh, my God. So depressing. Even, you know what? You know what? Uh, fuck this shit. Fuck this shit. Uh, let's, let's, just, let's just throw a nice uh, black paint on it for now. Uh, imagine that this was literally spray, spray, spray canned on, uh, so it's uh, a bit more you know, realistic, I guess, I don't know, and, um, yeah, let's see what we can, what, what's what, okay, yeah, th this is nice, completely red, very nice, I li really like when it's all red, so, um, so in theory, if I sell this thing, I would get six grand, let's see, so, Vlad, let me just tell you what Vlad told me, a few things about the suspension, and also, uh, the engine needs all black series parts, so we need all black series, and um, it needs the Mitsubishi hand and the Honda 2.2 block. Ooh, a 2.2 liter. And not, so not the 3.2 liter high RPM Promos one, but a Mitsubishi block. Yeah, he, no, he said the Mitsubishi head. Yeah, yeah, the Mits so the, the 2.2 block. Hmm, okay, well, let's, let's, let's just start buying things. Fuck it, I don't give a fuck. We've got five grand, uh, we can sell shit. Uh, so it needs pro mods. Is there anything pro mods here? The uh, black series, I mean. Oh baby, this thing is gonna fucking rip. Black series crankshaft. Oh man, forget about it. Yeah, he said. Oh black series parts. Oh baby, I'm gonna. Oh, oh for f maximum RPM, fourteen thousand, dude. Oh my god, can we build an engine for five grand? We can probably build an engine for five grand. Do you see black series? Holy shit, this thing is gonna rip, dude. I mean, I I did say last episode that we need we need a different. Um... Oh shit! There's two Mitsubishi. It's probably this one, the better one, the DDS BBC. Oh shit! Uh, there is three Mitsubishi engine blocks and uh, and uh, cylinder heads, and we need the best one, obviously. Is there a DC or something here? There is a DC normal head covers. These head colors and gaskets and whatnot. These might be cool, but I'm gonna check them out later because you know you need this to to, to make the car run. <laughs> um, but shit, like these are mostly visual cylinder heads, camshafts. Okay, DS. We need that DS. But, oh, look at oh shit, super high RPM all around or high RPM. Oh shit. I don't think we need super high RPM. I don't. These are the cheapest ones, which worries me. But we also are on a budget. I don't know, Vlad. You tell me. I'm gonna take the all arounds because all around is always good. Maybe maybe the high RPM ones would be better, or the ultra high ones. I don't know. You're gonna tell me once this thing comes out. Intake systems. We need some of that. We're not gonna go with the turbo. I think I can just. I think I can use the ones I got on my car. I'm pretty sure those are uh, individual DC, individual throttle rockers or whatever the fuck. I can use those from my car. They should be good. Uh, that was yeah, that was here. Exhausts. Okay, let's see a nice single boy. Mm. Real yeah, long deep nice fuel systems. I'm going all new on this car. Like okay. Hmm. It's probably I'm probably gonna use the ones on my car. Those sh those should work, I think. I don't know, from my engine, current engine, methanol. Uh, these are all things I don't particularly need. Performance tr transmission. Oh shit! This is where Vlad was like, go buy the uh, yeah, go buy the yeah. But it's a grand dude, a fucking grand for the six speed. We can go for the five speed because we are still drifting at the end of the day. But it's still six grand dude. I don't have the money for that, so I'm going to use my transmission, and, uh... Um... Am I going to buy new... No, I'm going to refurbish those. I mean, we gotta, we got to be out here thinking about the money. Um... Let's buy the Honda alternator. And the Sunstrip oil pan. And the Honda crank. And the bearings bridges and the camshaft belt so in theory we should have a engine on our on our hands but before that let's get this thing 
get get parts from it uh, I would also need this with differential and I would also need let me remove these parts so I need the, the clutch and the flywheel everything else I think should just stay here it has a it's got the, the it's it, I think this is the 1.5 liter engine that's what I'm I, I uh, no, 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 no. Yeah, it's, it's you do. We've been running fucking two, two, three hundred horsepower now. Three hundred, two hundred is two hundred horsepower on a one point five liter engine, and we expect things to uh, to go well. Um, yeah, okay, okay. So this is let's let's fix this part. For four or three dollars, yes, and it's back to ninety percent. Oh ho, yeah, it fits perfectly. The wow, well, this is actually perfect. This has no damage to it. That's great. Uh, eighty percent refurbished for one one dollar. It got one percent better. Uh, oh, I can't install this on on this. Oh, it has. Oh, I need to install it. Bef what? So this clutch doesn't work. So these, oh, okay, interesting, interesting, interesting. Let's go, let's go into, let's go. In, oh, interesting. Clutch and flywheel. Need a light flywheel type four. Which one is better? Yeah, the light one's probably better. The line for clutch. We got two other. Huh. Let's get this clutch, I guess. Huh, interesting, interesting. Let's, I don't know, buy one of these if something doesn't work. It should work. Uh, this, what is this? What was, what does this mean? What this? Okay, whatever. Parts being compatible. We don't need, we need to be car compatible, you know? Um. Okay, so we got the, but the clutch is not going on. Huh. So the flywheel itself is there, but the clutch does not want to does not want to be a part of this. Oh, there we go. There we go. Or the promotes clutch. I think the promotes clutch would be better. And we've got no money left. <laughs> I'm gonna sell a few things though, so we are okay. So the promotes clutch and the in this and if we see, yeah we don't need any of these. We don't need any of these, so if we sell them for three grand, let's go back into inline and the cylinder heads and the cylinder head color covers and one of the cooler ones. Um, cooler, cooler, I don't know how cooler these are, but longitude real wheel drive engines. Yeah, that's what we've got. I don't know, let's buy a few of these. I'm interested in which one, oh, which ones look the best. Uh, obviously, this is Oh, wasting quite a bit of money, but it's okay. It's it's okay. It's all Gucci. It's all Gucci, dudes. It's all Gucci. Let's install. Yeah, cause that. Oh, that looks pretty cool. That does look cool. It's got a it's got a fake ass air filter and shit. I like that. Where it's not connected to anything. That's that's how I like it. This one is simpler without the air filter. Um, this one has a L L fil air filter on the other side, right at the uh, hot side of the engine. That's that's what I like, you know. That's that's all the hot fumes are coming out of there, so that's the perfect place for a uh, for a L filter uh, air filter. So I'm, I'm gonna go with not this with this one because it's got a cooler air filter air filter position. Okay, boys, this is okay. That doesn't actually fit properly. Huh? Interesting. Um, this doesn't, this fits even less. I fucking, I'm, it's good enough. Oh, it's got a fake ass intercooler, oh. Oh, that's not good, no, 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 no fake ass intercoolers for me. Radiator, yeah, with a radiator, yeah, that works, that works. We've got two radiators and whatnot, this obviously needs to go up as an engine. Let's sell these, and, um, does the car start? Nope car seems to start let's go into gear let's remove the the thing yep the car moves that is that is great and what is our power output 306 
brake horsepower. It's at 10,000 RPM. 306 horsepower is just fucking, that's great actually, that's great. Uh, let's see, fuel rail. It's just got mixtures and whatnot. Okay, this is this is a solid engine. This has got 7.5. Um, so I'm gonna leave it at that. Then we've got a solid engine on our uh, on, uh, on on our hands. Hopefully this will survive for long. Uh, let's just. I want this to go up a bit because it's a bit too low. Yeah, okay, that's a bit too high. <laughs> that's definitely a bit. What the fuck happened? It's a bit too high. Let's go two down, which should be a. Yeah, that's good enough. Let's. I need the car to go into a good, stable position. Because we shall work on the suspension now. Okay, yeah, this engine fills up. Oh yeah, that looks that looks nice. But Vlad was like, go go super low. So let's try five inches. So uh, I will. I'm. What I want to do is combine. Uh, you know the best possible, the best possible setups for these cars, for this car. Uh, but I also want to combine real lifeness with it. So if it's if it looks ridiculous, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna drive with something that looks crazy. It looks like a stands boy, man. Holy shit, that's hot boy as fuck. Yeah, that engine is has no clearance. <laughs> it fucking has zero clearance. It, it is at five inches, so, so it's. It's super low. <laughs> it's, it's um. Hmm. All right, I'm gonna push it up a bit because this looks. There is no car that. It looks like this, especially in real life. Nobody drifts at something as low. I don't know. It, it was at seven inches before, right? What if we th throw it at six inches? I think it should. Uh, it should be good. It's, I can't find the the, the spring. It's so low that the spring is gone. It has, it, has, it has left. Oh, there! Oh, there it is. It has left this uh, this world. It seems. I mean, I found it, so it hasn't. But let's get the car up a bit because six inch, uh, five inches. <laughs> that's a bit low. That's a bit low. Let's let's. I'm gonna try it out like this because this episode has been nothing but me talking, talking, talking. What does that even mean? It's not. It's not being. It's not. It's ah it, it, oh, fuck. Okay, the car. Has definitely been transformed, and we actually have two grand left. Oh yeah, I like this. Yeah, yeah, definitely like this. This is going to be good. Let's go and test it out on the on the track. A nice day out here in the Sujuku uh, Heights. Heights, <laughs> the Sujuku. It's still definitely a third gear engine. It feels much more comfortable being in third gear. Oh my! Look at the points. Look at the look at the drifting, dude. Look at the drifting. Outrageous. Lowering the car definitely changed the setup. Feels much nicer now. Monster drift. Oh my! Look at the points. Look at it. Oh my god, dude. We got them points going on. Engine is still green. I am definitely... This engine can go to a higher RPM. But I am uh, definitely... Uh, babying it. I'm not trying to push it hard from the start. But, dude, we're making a ton of points. Holy shit. Monster drift. Yeah, the car. This is visibly better. The car is also quite stable uh, when it's this low. He, he Vlad also said something about the camber. I need to work on the camber too. Uh, especially the rear camber should not be like that. Should not be equal to the front camber. Oh, that was a jump drift. Why? Why no points for the jump drift? Jump drift. Why am I not getting any points here? Oh. Yeah, I'm just. Is, I'm regulate, regulating the, the throttle, so it, I'm, I'm almost never going full full ham. Just just so the car is uh, lives long. Oh, look at the engine; it's still going strong. Oh, baby! Also, the car now bl being black looks much nicer. 
I still got those fake ass tea leaves, but it is what it is. So, uh, so next episode might be a grinding money episode, so we can get a good amount of money and make the car look nice. At least get some parts on it, because I still want to have a bunch of money ready in case something happens, like a crash or something. Because uh, I'm going to start taking this out to other places that are more risky to drive on, because this is uh, this is this is pretty safe. It's very hard to to hit something, you know, like that. Oh shit! What the fuck? Oh no! If the car doesn't flip, oh no! Yeah, I can't, I can't, I can't fix the car. It's it's stuck like this. I'm not gonna get any money. I think at least that happened just as I was saying that what's gonna what what could happen on that track? And uh, it's, it seems like a lot of things can happen on that track. <laughs> uh, shit, we lost doors. When I get the one door is working, uh, the, the fender is fucked. Only one fender. Uh, yeah. Did I mean yeah? That that's that happened here. <laughs> Shit! How could that happen? Right? When? Oh my god! Such a noob move. Well, guys, thank you for watching this episode of budget drifting on a budget. <laughs> and uh, next episode, we will be going even harder on drifting. And after that, I'm going to be making the car look nice, because it looks like shit now. Good, uh, no, good night. Uh, thank you for watching. I'm going to see you in the next one.